Hey, it's so Scott at Leading Edge Archery. Um, I wanted to go over some cool new product that we're offering um, on our bows. And a lot of you may or may not know, but we make our own custom strings in-house here at Leading Edge. And we've developed, we think, is the ultimate string for the Mountain West Hunter. Um, and they are absolutely so far in testing going on their third year uh, are turning out really nice. Um, we're making what we call the Mountain String. And it is a string and cable system that is 100% served top to bottom. There's only a couple of areas we don't have serving and we have about an inch and a quarter here on this cable and about an inch and a quarter here on this cable. The only reason we left those open with no serving is it allows us to twist the strings if we have timing issues that we need to address uh, because if it was fully served we would not be able to do that. And, and so far working out really well. The entire string all the way around with the exception of this small location here on the peep is completely served. So this string pretty much top to bottom is almost all serving. The reason we're doing that if you ever hunted out west in the mountains you'll know that the, the lack of moisture, the arid dry air up there just sucks everything out of the string and they start to get the frays, um, the little fuzzies we call them, they'll start to get really pre prevalent with your string which is really the string aging at a very rapid pace. Um, we feel this string is going to solve that issue. Um, a lot of questions came up about, you know, what are we getting on speeds? How are we doing the cables? You know, some of the bows like this one here will run a 28 strand cable to help um, cable integrity. They will stretch at a much, much slower rate and not move near as often, if at all. Um, and then still stay with the 24 strand string because we're making the string a lot heavier with all the serving material, of course. Um, it's been kind of cool though. We've actually experienced um, bow speeds losing no more than about a one to two feet per second. Um, most of the strings are staying pretty much standard um, to their current speed or in, in some instances we've had, for example, this Hoy has picked up up to four feet per second. A lot of that's got to be to do with the inertia that is driven through the string. We do have the speed knocks on this string and, uh, and whenever we're getting the string heavier it's creating more inertia when it's going through a cycle which I believe is creating the speed numbers that we're getting out of it. Um, I think the big thing is though is the longevity and the life of the string. We're, like I said, we've got a set that's been on a bow now going on its third year. Um, the guy that uses it hunts extremely hard and shoots a lot of archery with it. And right now I can tell you I've replaced his loop more times than I have even looked at the string for any deterioration and wear. Um, I firmly believe that we're going to get somewhere between three to five years out of these strings depending on how much they're shot and maybe even longer. Um, the, the, the nice thing is also is the serving, is, I mean the cable stretch is almost non-existent and very minimal um, and we love that because tuning issues become almost a, a no problem whatsoever. And also the peep alignment and the peep movement, we're getting almost none. Um, because once again, we're locking that string in with a very tight serving, which is not allowing any material to keep moving and stretching on its own accord, which is a lot of the, the problems a lot of technicians have when they're in there, you know, readjusting strings after that original break-in period. Um, so I'll tell you what, if, you, if you're interested, uh, you need to give us a call. We can make these in any colors whatsoever on our serving. We're using pretty much halo serving on everything. Um, in regards to actually the serving we use across the, the, the whole platform of the string, with the exception of the middle here where the, uh, the loop is going to be tied on, we use a power grip. Um, but so far, uh, in the two years of testing, we were really excited about where the string is going to take us. Now, there's a lot of serving on this, and you know, if you're a price halo serving, it's not cheap. Um, this string will go up in price, it's at 225 versus 160 for a typical standard string. And believe it or not, a lot of that is just in the material cost, not so much our labor. It does take us a little more time, of course, to serve the entire string from top to bottom. But um, uh, it's still at, at 225, getting potentially three to five years life out of that string, that is uh, a bargain uh, for you guys that shoot a lot or go out west and hunt and knowing you're replacing those strings year after year after year. So uh, give us a call. You know, we ship all over the country. We can make your bow, uh, definitely a set of these. Um, I, I'm pretty confident you'll be extremely happy with them. We've now done uh, this year, we kind of rolled them out this year locally at our shop and we've got about seven or eight sets out there and the results so far have been absolutely outstanding. Um, really excited about this product. Um, I think it's something if you're a Mountain West hunter you need to really take a look at. Uh, I, I think it's going to get your bow in a, in a, with a lot more integrity, a lot less movement, 
you'll go up there with, a, I think, more comfortable about the tune of your bow, the accuracy and the speeds not changing near as much as a typical regular factory string or even a, even the string we build that is a non-serve, um, all-serve string that you've experienced in the past. So give us a call. We're once again excited. Uh, we think we'll, you'll love this product.